Oh my gosh, you're going to love this and pick the perfect time to tune in. I have a willpower intelligence. Now, if you're doing anything that requires willpower, like dieting or cutting back on spending, experts say try using your non-dominant hand more often. So if you're a righty, you stir your coffee with your left hand, hold the cup in your left hand. Re reach for door coffee black. What am I supposed to do? Reach for door handles with your left, etc. That's because willpower is like a muscle. We need to exercise it to make it stronger. And so you use a lot of will to use your non-dominant hand? Is that the, the you, takeaway? You, 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 practice, you practice exercising willpower. So our non-dominant hand takes our brain off autopilot, forcing us to think and, and think more. So this comes from psychologist Roy Baumeister. The author of Willpower. What is Meister, using I love him. your left hand, or if you're righty, what does that have to do with willpower? How does it's it teach, connect? It's, it's teaching you how, how. It's teaching you to to uh, be mindful, so you're not mindlessly eating. So in other words, oh, yeah, oh, it makes it okay. easier when you when you practice your willpower. According to Dr. Baumeister, it makes it easier to override other habits like watching TV with a bag of chips in your lap. If you eat with the left hand. Because it's harder. To, oh, I wasn't getting that. Because yeah, it's, it, okay. yeah, it's harder to do. Because you have to focus okay. and you have to make the conscious decision to use your non-dominant hand. So you eat less. Yeah. You remember I started trying this for another reason. I was trying to but brush see, my teeth with my I, left hand. That's making it harder to eat, but it's not, to me, it's not exercising your willpower. But, your so, willpower is the ability not to pick up the chip. But what that does is it, your, your, your brain is going, ah, oh, don't use the right hand, use the left. And that forces your brain to focus on the task, right. which means that you're activating your brain, which flexes that right. willpower muscle. Oh, okay. yeah. And then, and then that in general will make you, your brain will be able to say, actually, you know what? I don't need. It you. takes your brain off of autopilot, is what they And just it will also prevent Alzheimer's because we've talked about that on the show. Right. They're using your non-dominant yeah. hand to do everyday tasks. There's going to be a lot of messes in cars and. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'm going to use my left hand for all sorts of stuff, and it's, it's just going to be a disaster. Yeah, that's how to amp up your willpower.